Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today we have a nail video. Finally, it's been a minute. Um, but I know some of you guys are really into the nail stuff like I am. For those of you guys that didn't know, I obviously love makeup, but I also do my own nails. So I'm just as obsessed with nail stuff. <laughs> I have a mini haul today that I wanted to share with you guys, but more than anything, I'm more excited to swatch these little gels. Sometimes I find some really good stuff on Amazon, and I don't know why I never think to come and share with you guys, but here I am today. So if you're new around here, welcome. My name is Jackie. I'm so glad that you're here. If you like the vibe, please don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell to get notified every time I upload a new video, or as often as I do to be... <laughs> You guys, please just subscribe. This is like the 30th time that I'm filming this intro. I'm out of breath. <laughs> anyway, let's get into the video. Okay, y'all. I pushed those little gels out of the way, but here's my Amazon package. So let me check out everything. Well, it's not my full order, but <laughs> it'll have to do. So the first thing that I wanted to show you guys was this ceramic drill bit. This is a ceramic safety drill bit, and it looks like this. Let me see if I can get the little lid off of it. Um, I have talked about this before. It is a fine coarse, or however you want to say that, um, drill bit. And these ones are good. Well, I like to use it. Um, when I'm done with my most of my shaping, I just like to go back in with this one, or I just shape completely with this one, because most of the time I don't have a lot of shaping to do. Um, and I just find that the safety drill bit is way better you can get closer to the cuticle without hurting yourself without cutting yourself or anything like that this is for acrylic use um but if you are into gel and that kind of stuff you can also find these these are um sanding bands these are the fine or let me see how these ones are labeled here because they label them differently these are by melody susan by the way and it doesn't say, but I want to say they are the fine. And these ones you can use um, on your natural nail if you need to prep for gel or anything like that. Um, so these come in handy for that. And you can also find the little, oh my gosh, I think it's called like man, mandrel or something like that. I'll leave it linked in the description as well because I get them all on Amazon. Um, but they have different colors and I got purple this time and they're super cute. So the other product that I got was this 2X course or XX course or I don't know what other names they might call it, but it's clearly a more coarse drill bit and I will show you the difference here compared to the fine. Um, and I would use something like this one um, to remove. If you have like a lot of bulk, I mean, this could be helpful, um, but I never really have that much bulk. This is more to remove the acrylic nails. Um, and as you can see, it's a lot more wider and it's gonna grab a lot more product and take it off. I just really wanna remind you guys, these are best for acrylic nails or even like um, gel extensions or something like that, but not on your natural nail. It's better to use a hand file or sanding bands because you don't wanna like ruin your nails or hurt yourself or anything like that. So moving into the main event, <laughs> I'm trying to keep this short and sweet for you guys, um, but I picked up these gel polishes from Beatles. It's supposed to be six neon colors, and I'm so excited because I don't know why I got this little urge to do super neon nails, and I don't know if that's going to actually happen, but I'm excited to try these because these just randomly popped up. Here's a little info on the sides of the box if you're interested and you just want to like pause and read it. Um, but I am so excited for these because they look super promising, the reviews were super promising, and they were only $13.99. So, let's see the inside here. Sorry guys, I'm trying not to move this so much, but you have a little application guide, and it'll walk you step by step on how to apply. Um, I believe this is... For the natural nail which is always usually the most helpful um because acrylics you know you could be a little more rough but not on your natural nail so these are these six colors oh i'm so excited okay so i think i'm gonna go ahead and let you guys watch in a little bit of a faster situation so y'all don't have to watch it in real time because i'm trying to keep it short and sweet like i said <laughs>
y'all so that was the swatches for these and how pretty do they look and how bright are they so again these ones were $13.99 which if you divide the price per polish um that is about two dollars 30 something cents um the top coat that i use also i wanted to mention it because um i've picked this up on amazon as well and sometimes i have really good deals i've picked up like buy one get one free a couple times buy two get one free um either way they're really inexpensive already so getting one for free and as you can see it is a nice top coat obviously we don't know how long these are gonna last these gel polishes but i will say the quality seems very similar to some of those higher end ones um this one right here which was shade 752 um this one does look like it's supposed to be more of like a jelly type of finish um but the rest are pretty good i would say the yellow one is the most like see-through-y one and this was all one coat per swatch so i mean easily you could do a second coat and it would be just as good as the other ones that purple one though whew, they all look so pretty um but anyway you guys um i do want to point out that the bottles are a little smaller just before i go um so this is a i believe it's a 0.5 ounce this is a 0.25 ounce but still honestly for the quality so far um i feel like that's still a really really good price if you're into the gels um and doing your nails with gels and stuff like that but that's gonna be it from me you guys i wanted to keep it short and sweet um if you have any questions you can let me know down below in the comments um i will leave the products that i mentioned in the link or in the links below they are not sponsored or anything like that um but if you're interested and you try them out let us know how you like them um i should be using some of these very very soon if you want to see how they wear or anything like that um you can follow me over on my instagram but yeah that's gonna be it from me thank you guys so much for joining me today and i will see you guys in my next one adios